<sighs> so they're breaking off. Oh, they're here. Oh, it's moving up. Another forma forma doing a formation here. Now they're on the road again, up to uh, the hills. Oh, well, let's ignore them and focus on what we have. We have TDBVs and the Strela 10. They're probably shot down this helicopter. I'm looking for vengeance, so let's... let's first of all, I'm going to deploy these guys just before I forget about them. And I'm going to get my artillery and fire on that Strela. Now I'm going to lose fish along it. It's just this recon unit really is blind sometimes. Looks like they're launching an assault. I really do. I, I really want a Regon helicopter at this stage. Actually, let's. Okay, no, you're probably best where you are. Let's get an Urx again out. Unfortunately, because I've selected these guys, I no longer know where those BTR 70s are. Ah, well. All the VMs are here. What's the ego up there? Delta secured with nine minutes left. What else to deploy? Deploy another Mahistro over on this side. Get an air force. Uh, I'm gonna be a bit gutted if we go through this whole campaign and I did nothing but lose a helicopter because I was bored. Uh, I really would suck. Because I don't like you losing your units pointlessly. Let's recruit these guys. They'll be good. It'll be a good machine gun defense for any enemy infantry that try and attack the town. And these will be a good MK attack for any infantry that are shot out of their transports by the ATKMs. Although I am glad that I didn't buy a Crusader to shoot that thing down because then I would have lost one of these and realistically these Crusaders are more valuable. This is, that helicopter never really shot down much. Get the arcs again. I'm going to use this because it's got some decent armor on it. Can, let's see, it's got one all over. Well, I don't know, the AML 90s just as good. But I think the arcs again has got some more firepower to it. It's got an F1 auto cannon. Actually, no, that isn't an F1 auto cannon, is it? Doesn't look like one anyway. Maybe they've got an F1 cannon. But I'm pretty sure there's a. In, in European escalation, there was definitely an F1 auto cannon, but I can't remember if that doesn't look like it though. The stats don't match up. Let's buy some more mortars. Another Mal Valmahistro. Let's move you up, guess so we can see some enemy units. Even if it's just so I can move it up, see the enemy units, select the enemy units, and then follow their circles around for another six minutes. Ah, oh, I am bored. It's gonna be like that other mission where nothing happened, except I lost some units pointlessly. Still, when you think about it, the Dima are doing well considering the amount of fighting they've had to do over this series. About 75% of all fights have been with the Dima versus some Soviet force. I would like to go on the aggression, but with for, with aggression, you need you, you need a unit that can beat their units, and the T80 is just a, 
All I have are these sort of ATKMs, which are really good for defense artillery, which is so good for support and attack, not for attacking itself. Planes, which are too easily countered. More ATKM units that are defensive only. Infantry, which is I barely have any in, of infantry left. See, I really don't have that much. I know what do we got here. Some Ural supply trucks. Unfortunately, they're moving too fast, so I won't really be able to get an accurate shot on them. Unless they stop. Let's just select them and see where they go. Is there a track cam option in this, or do you just zoom in? There we go. Wow, those are graphics are really bad because of my computer. Well, at least we can tell us how far this thing can actually see. I'm going to do some probing. If I can capture echo, that might be nice. Actually, what am I saying? Capturing echo wouldn't make any difference. I don't have many of these things to play around with, considering how quickly recon units can be lost in battle. Too much of a risk to take Echo. Guess like it was too much of a risk to send that helicopter to shoot down one recon helicopter. Keep zooming in on it because it's a, bit the, it's a reminder of the only action that happened in this game. Interesting going on. Anything else? I can spend some points and buy a Crusader. Let's try and. Um, I wonder if I fly the Crusader around a bit. Will that encourage them to deploy a cat or something? Look at us, we can fly cats around for no reason whatsoever. Oh, hello. I think it's tempting me now. I can actually see it from that distance. That, that must be the Crusader because as it's circling around. Oh, hello. Yep. Second Crusader, come in here. It's a bit dog fight. Okay, here we go. Crusader's taking some hits and the Crusader's dying. Do we lose? Do they lose anything? I would, I mean. Well, there we go. They brought in some cats, and our anti-aircraft defense didn't do anything. That crusader just got wiped out. Yeah, maybe we shouldn't try and invite cats over it. This has been a really bad battle from my perspective. I literally haven't done anything, and we've lost two anti-aircraft units. Frankly, the, you know, the Crusader didn't do anything to those cats anyway. That's six. There we go, there's our Crusader. A really bad interceptor. Like, it was over our territory, it knew they were coming. It is an air superiority fighter. If we look at the Crusader, where is it? Get info on it? No, it's still being repaired. It's an air superiority fighter, just take my word for it. All it's meant to do is shoot down planes and then they just come in and have their way with it. And then another one comes in, so it isn't even like they were outnumbered. One, they come in, shoot it down, but then this guy comes in and does nothing. Gets damaged as well, which is why it's taking so long to become available again. It's fashion random shots out. If we kill their CV, that would be something funny. It just shows how badly an army needs a good a AA force because otherwise cats can just come in. I mean, if those were ground attack planes, there's a lot of delicate units down there they would have killed. 
In fact, actually, well, this guy's half dead. Why are you not? He must be out to the repair zone. Better get yourself fixed up, mate. So not only did they shoot down a yeah, they nearly killed one of my EGM force units. Great job, mate. Right, let's fire our artillery at that. Can we destroy that in 20 seconds? Doubt it, but... So there we go, this probably ends one of the more disappointing episodes where I literally haven't done anything and only lost units. But they lost initiative and haven't really advanced anywhere in terms of sector control, so... Call that a victory? I wouldn't, but... Yeah, whatever. It's a draw. Let's see what the next episode's battle will be. Hopefully it'll be more exciting than that. Now you see they're really low on initiative now. The fighting is another fight with the Dima. Great. Well, I'll see you next time. Until next time, this has been Omergent. He's getting really bored of all these stupid battles. Saying goodbye.